Hello again, everyone. Welcome to another episode of Train Lab. And as always, it's on the lab coat, so it's official. So today's a very special day. It was exactly one year ago today that Train Lab 1 started. And that's where I put out this car. Well, this is a sister car of the one I put outside for one year to see how it would weather naturally. And being in New York State, we have extreme weather changes, so the car outside is exposed to about zero degrees to about 95 degrees. Lots of rain, snowstorms, hail, sleet. At one point, the car was four feet under snow. And I kid you not, we had a massive snowstorm last winter. So let's go outside, retrieve the car, bring it back here to the train room, and compare the new car to the weather car that's been outside for one year. Okay, as you remember, this is my backyard where the test took place on the official train lab track. So let's take the car in and compare it to a brand new car that's the same uh, paint scheme. Okay, so here we have a brand new model power HO metal train 40 foot box car right out of the box nice and clean no discoloration and here we have the sister car that was outside for one year and as you can see the color has changed because they were the same color when I started and she does have a lot of dirt and material. I don't think the black faded too much. A lot of dirt on there. Like I said, remember this thing's been out in snow, rain, sun. I didn't put in direct sunlight. It was in a shaded, somewhat shaded area. Probably got about an hour sunlight a day during the summer. But there's yeah, a lot of schmutz on it. And the, even the wheels, let me see. They're a little discolored. And you know what, they're, they're not rusty or anything. They spin freely. I don't think of the, you know, it's like the doors won't open. Ugh, I'm getting dirt in my hands as I touch it. Yeah, the doors don't, oh, there we go. Thankfully, nothing came out of there. But as you can see, comparing the two, quite a color difference. And you know, it really didn't weather as much as I thought it would. But this is die cast, die cast doesn't really rust. And, uh, but it's been an interesting experiment. I hope you enjoy seeing, I didn't do show you every month because it's kind of getting, you know, boring, I think, because it didn't change a whole lot. But as you can see, you can somewhat naturally weather a train car outside if you want to kill a year. But it's been fun. And, uh, you know, I kind of say it's over, but, you know, it's been interesting. It was a cool experiment. I have uh, many more ideas for Train Lab if I get my lazy fanion gear and do them. So I hope you enjoyed this uh, Train Lab experiment. And I'll catch you down the tracks.